Hi guys, in this video I am going to discuss about quadratic equation in programming language. So first I am going to discuss about what quadratic equation is. So I know the standard form of quadratic equation is uh, uh, this one. fx ax, ax square plus bx plus c. So here we have to enter a, b, c value. So add here a. So I am going to enter a value 1 and b value minus 5 and or c value I am going to enter 4 so here a value is 1 1 into x square the value come x square and uh, here plus b value is now I enter minus 5 into x and c value I enter 4 so add here plus and minus the value come minus So x square the value of minus 5x so 4 equal to 0. So this is one quadratic equation. And here one important point is a not equal to 0. Suppose if I given a equal to 0. So add your 0 into x square the value come or 0 and your plus minus of 5x the value come suppose add your a value is 0 b value is minus of 5 c equal to 4 so quadratic equation looks like minus 5x plus 4 so this is not a quadratic equation so add your a not equal to 0 so suppose this is the example so add your we have to find out the value of x1 and x2 so this is the basic formula so add here minus 5 so b value is now 5 oh sorry minus 5 so add here minus 5 so first is b value is now minus 5 and here one more minus plus So add your a square root of b a square. So minus into minus 5 into minus 5 the value come 25. So one important point is plus into minus the value come minus minus into or plus the value come minus. And your minus into minus the value come plus and your plus into plus the value come plus so add here minus 5 into minus 5 b square means minus 5 into minus 5 the value come or 25 minus 4 a c so a value is 1 and or 4 c value is 4 so 4 into or 4 the value come 16 so that divided by or 2a. So a value is now 1. 2 into 1 the value come 2. So add here minus, in, minus into minus the value come plus. So add here the value is 5. And uh, here you can write plus and minus. So I am going to take this value also. So add here 25 minus 16 the value come 9. And the square root of 9. In 10th class, we study about a square root, the value come 3. So, this value is now 3, and here after 2. So, one time 5 plus 3, and next time 5 minus 3. So, 5 plus 3, the value come 8. So, 8 by 2, and next time 5 minus 3, the value come 2, 2 by 2. So, 8 by 2, the value come 4, and 2 by 2, the value come 1. So the output get 4 and 1. So this is about to quadratic equation. Next I am going to write a programming code of a quadratic equation. So let's see.
Next time I'm going to discuss what the dry end method of this program. So if you divide the code control comes to main method here after that coincide. So I have created a scanner class object SC by using new keyword a scanner class system dot in. Here after I have taken double type variable a b c d x1 and x2. So first is a here after b next is or c and d x1 and x2 so here after control comes to this point system class dot alt dot print and method so what are we double code that display to the output screen so right here enter the value of a b and c so that display to the output screen and here whatever i'm going to enter so that is by a b and c so right here a equal to sc dot next int method so what are string value that come so next it method that convert into integer and integer value go to a so at here i'm using sc object so sc object with the help of dot operator that call next in method so here i'm going to enter a value of 1 b value minus 5 and c value Four. Here after control comes to this point if a not equal to zero. So a value is one, one not equal to zero, condition is true that coincides. So at your d equal to b into b. So b is now minus five. Minus five into minus five, the value come twenty five. So at your one more point minus into minus the value come plus and your minus into or plus the value come minus and next plus into minus the value come minus at your plus into or plus the value come plus so at your minus 5 into minus 5 the value come 25 minus 4 ac so a value is 1 c value is 4 so 4 into uh, 1 into 4, the value comes 16. So at your 25 minus 16, the value comes 9. This value is 25, b into p, or 5 into 5, 25, and here 4 into 4, the value comes 16. So 25 minus 16, the value comes 9. So 9 go to d. Since if condition is true, so that not go to else part, here control comes to this point. So I tell the same thing, or d equal to b into b minus 4ac. So b into b minus 5 into minus 5, the value come 25, 25 minus 4, a into c. So a value is 1, c value is 4, 4 into 4, the value come 60. So 25 minus 60, so or d is now. 9. At here I am using d equal to b into b minus 4 ac so this is unnecessary thing. If you mark as a comment this point then the error come. The error come d not in Israel. So that I used d at here. Now next is control comes to this point. If or d greater than equal to 0 so 9 greater than equal to 0 condition is to that coincide so at here d equal to math dot sqrt d so d value is 9 and sqrt function uh, we already know because we have to we study sqrt function in 7th or 9th class so what sqrt function do so whatever the value so 9 it's come so that is square root so square root means so uh, this is uh, square t 9 so that to square root so 9 so at here 3 or uh, 9 3 into 3 it's come 9 and if you remove this one so and here 3 into 3 the value come is 3 power 2 and here this value is 1 by 2 so 1 by or uh, 2 to cancel 3 power 1 the value come 3 so math is the class
that call is called a uh, method so d uh, pass 9 so this value is now 3 so d is 3 now now here after x1 equal to minus b plus t so minus b so add here minus b and one more minus and here plus d value so d value is 3 by 2 so minus into minus the value come or plus minus into minus plus so add here 5 plus 3 8 8 by 2 the value come 4 so 4 go to x1 so add here x this value is now 4 and here x2 equal to minus b minus t so minus into in place of this plus we have to give minus only minus change and here yeah, minus minus 5 minus 3 so add your minus into minus so this is now 5 and 5 minus 3 the value come to 2 by 2 the value come 1 so x2 is now 1 and a is uh, 2 into 1 the value come 2 so 2 by 2 the value come 1 here after system cross dot r dot print ln method so x1 so this r display into the output scheme the value of x1 so x1 value is 4 the output come x1 equal to 4 and here system cross dot r dot print ln method so x2 equal to x2 value so x2 value is 1 so 1 display so at a if condition is true let not go to else part so here yeah, the output comes x1 equal to 4 and x2 equal to 1. Or suppose if I enter a value like uh, I'm giving the equation minus 5x plus 4 equal to 0. So at here I've enter a value 0. So what happened at this point? So at here check the condition 0 not equal to 0. Condition is uh, false so that not go to n span. So at here control comes to else part here. System class dot r dot print error method. So the output is filling quantity equation not possible. And here after d equal to b into b. So b value i enter minus 5 minus 5 into minus 5 25 and 4 ac. A value is 0. So 4 into 0 into 4. So this value is not 0. So d value is 25 and here check the condition if d greater than equal to 0, 25 greater than equal to 0, condition is true. So add your math dot s squared t. So s square root of 25, the value come 5. So 5 go to d. So d is now 5. And here after here, yeah, minus b, minus 5, minus minus plus and 5 plus and d value also 5. So 5 plus 5, the value come 10 and 2 into 0. So 10 by 0. So if you divide any number with 0, so the value come infinity. And here minus 5. So this value is 5 and here d value is 5. So 5 minus 5, 0. And 0 by 0, the value come 0. So this is the try and method of this program. So I hope you understand. So next time you should try to enter a value minus 1, b value minus 5, c value minus 4 and or do the same try and method. So definitely you will get the expected output. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next week.